Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. So today I am going to be playing on Forza Horizons 3. And I am going to kind of be showing off this car while also doing the Hot Wheels Goliath. I know I did that in the last video too. But I'm going to I'm trying to find the best car for the Hot Wheels Goliath. And this is just one of the steps in the whole process of finding that. Um, so, I'm going to kind of give you guys the rundown on the stats and all that, the 0 to 60 for this car, and I will, yeah, and then afterwards at the end of this video, uh, I will go to the Hot Wheels Goliath race, and you guys can watch a lap of that. So just a quick rundown of the stats, um, the stock horsepower on this thing is, uh, 1,341 horsepower. Which is pretty good, so I I have a feeling this is going to fare pretty well on the Hot Wheels Goliath track in time-wise. Um, it's got 1,010 foot-pounds of torque, which again, is pretty good. It's going to get it somewhere in the race. Uh, I'm guessing farther than the Bentley's time in last video. And then it's just under 3,000 pounds at 200, or 2,998 pounds, which also kind of helps... For the weight and everything it makes this thing kind of scoot which it does <laughs> you can kind of see this thing picks up speed and keeps speed so um the top speed that i found for this is 268.8 which again is pretty good i don't know if i'm gonna reach my top speed on the goliath because it's got a whole lot of twists and turns but i might be able to get somewhere close and i'm hoping i will but um Averaging all of it out, not including the top speed, but averaging all of this out, um, it is roughly um, 1,783, which those that number will be useful later on when we can compare other vehicles to this vehicle using that average. Um, but without further ado, let's just head over to the airport for some more testing before the Goliath race. Oh, well, that didn't take too long. Okay, um, well... In that case, we're already here, so let's get on with the rest of the testing. Uh, so what I was planning on doing here was doing a 0-60, to 0-100, and a 0-200 to 200 test. Uh, what I'm going to do for this is I'm going to run down uh, and hopefully get to 200 miles per hour by the end of the track. And I will display the times that I get and how long it took me to get to that specific speed. Um, on the screen so you guys can see it. Um, so anyway, let's just kind of get on with it. So, there's 0 to 60, there's 0 to 100, and it's going to take a minute, but there is 0 to 200. Okay. So that actually did not take too long. But so far, I am taking a while to get onto the Goliath race, so let's get straight there. Okay, well, I just arrived in Thrilltopia, so that is a good sign. So let's go and find this Goliath right here. Okay, so I am going to set up the Goliath event, and you guys can just sit back, relax, and enjoy the race.
Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out.